So I wanted to jump on here and wish you all a Merry Christmas from the Wilson clan and our household. And I hope you're enjoying the last minute festivities of rapping and listening to Christmas music and just slowing it down a little bit and know that whatever you got done is enough. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to jump on. Sometimes we need a last minute gift. And I actually have people I won't be seeing for a couple of weeks. So if you have the same, this might be an option for you also. This was a gift bag I received from a coworker and I'm absolutely in love. So she gave me this cute little bag here and then she gave me some Dawn dish soap. And what she did is just, I don't know if she actually handmade this or you can actually purchase these on Etsy or maybe a friend makes them, but it's a scrubby cloth. My sister made me one and I love them. They are crocheted and they're kind of a um, plastic sort of feel to it, but they scrub pots and pans and dishes oh so good. So what a great gift. Give somebody something practical. Dawn's dish soap and this scrubby. Now I know this size soap, this is, what is this? Oh, let's see if I can spot it. Hang on a second. I can't even read it. It's too tiny, but this is something you can get at the Dollar Tree. So this is a dollar. I don't know if she made this herself, but this would be probably a couple dollars if you added that or just add your own, you know, just a cute sponge or something to go with it. I loved the practicality of that. Then in this cute little jar with the little snowflake on the top, she did a pretty ribbon and she added a little card and she put on here, Vanilla chai, add two to three teaspoons to eight ounces of hot water. So homemade vanilla chai. I don't have the recipe for this, but I'm sure you can get one on Pinterest. I did make one years ago and it included powdered milk, um, coffee creamer that was vanilla flavored. I forget what else, but anyway, you can easily go on Pinterest and find a recipe for that. Now look at this. Okay, here we go. A nice close up for you. This is a snowman. This is a Tic Tac. I don't know what these are actually, but I'm sure you could come up with something. This is made out of pretzels. Let me turn it over so you can see. It's those little uh, pretzel sticks. So you got your vanilla or your white chocolate here, your milk chocolate. She put one on top with a little snowflake. And I'm sure you could improvise on the nose and the eyes and do whatever you want. They sell all kinds of little kits with all these snowflake things, but check that out. Now, what a great gift to make with the kids to do as a family project, even on Christmas Eve tonight, just to go ahead and make something like that as a family project that you could eat. I think that's an absolute adorable little snowman. You could do that on Christmas Day. Sometimes the kids are just at each other. Run out now and get some chocolate and some extras to put, you know, for the nose, the Tic Tacs and the eyes or the snowflake and the chocolates, and you can pick those up right at the grocery store and have something fun to do, or even during winter break while the kids are home. Now check this one out as well. There we go. Now again, you can buy these little things. I've seen them at Walmart. You can buy kits, but it doesn't even have to be that. You could come up with something else. This was a peppermint patty cookie that you can already purchase. I think they're called grasshoppers maybe. But anyway, you can purchase that. This is a marshmallow that she dipped in chocolate. She said she stuck on here and then she just piped around some of the melted vanilla um, or white chocolate until it hardened to make a hat, added a little sediment. And again, you can be creative and do what you want with that. So look at that, look how cute. Okay, and then I got a bag of, um, I think they call it reindeer mix, I don't even know. But it has, it looks like the white chocolate mini Kit Kats and chocolate morsels and pretzels and M&Ms and nuts and some other kind of chocolate something I don't even know. And she put it in a cute little bag that has Christmas lights on it. I tell you, that was probably one of my favorite gifts I received this year. Yep, there's my little... Um, Oh, thing I got from Dollar General, the little jar, and sorry for the tissue box in the back, but you know, this is real life here, and my little Christmas tree from Dollar General, and this, I don't remember who gave me that, but that was last year, 
little Volkswagen, so I've added that to it. And this here was also from Dollar General. But I just wanted to come on real quick, short video, just to show you one awesome gift. So again, you're looking for last minute gift ideas that you can put together tonight. You're looking for things to make with the family, some fun projects, or even some chai tea, something practical. You can even throw this together for getting together for the holidays. You know, tonight, tomorrow, go pick up a few of these things. Also great ideas, the kids are home, they're antsy, great things they can put together. And again, myself, I will be seeing people in another week or two. So some of my gifts, sometimes I wait and I put those together later. So here's something that you could even make for them as a last minute treat. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you're having a Merry Christmas and we'll catch up with you guys after the holidays. Bye-bye.